Hello, and welcome to the delayed exception handling session of Code Rage 3. This is Jim McKeith. I'm a Delphi developer with Wide Orbit, but you may recognize me as the host of the podcast at Delphi.org, or my appearances in such Code Rage sessions as Exceptional Exceptions and Class Helpers, Friend or Foe. I'm glad you're able to join me for this session. I'm sure a lot of you may be wondering what exactly delayed exception handling is and why that would be useful. What I'm proposing is a new way to handle exceptions in some specific and complex situations. Additionally, this is a fairly complex and advanced session that's going to dive deep into exception handling and the way exceptions work. So even if you don't use delayed exception handling, I'm sure you'll find some things that you can use in a variety of situations in your software development. So a quick overview of what we're going to cover. First thing, we're going to talk about what the problem with traditional exception handling is. Now, traditional exception handling is great, but like I said, in some specific situations, it doesn't, isn't the best solution. So a proposed solution is the delayed exception handling. So we're going to go into the implementation of that, which you may refer to as code, and then we're going to do a demonstration of it, which you could refer to as more code. Finally, I'll give you some more information where you can download the code, and we'll call this links. Exceptions. I'm sure you all know what they are, and their purpose is, of course, to provide an immediate escape. If something goes wrong, an emergency happens, something unexpected occurs, we have an exception. Exception gives your code, your flow of code, an immediate escape. Now, sometimes we don't want an immediate escape. Sometimes we want to free some memory that was allocated. And if the code aborts at that point, then the memory doesn't get allocated, be allocated. Or it could be an external resource, which, of course, could be even worse than, than unfreed memory. So Delphi luckily provides a solution for this. And that solution is for us programmers to wrap risky operations 